Now, certificates for a no answer. Given the graph G, there does not seem to be a way to validate a no answer, a certificate. This is that not in general. There's no way to explain to a computer, to a referee. There isn't one. And, and then to have the referee check your answer and say efficiently, you're right, there isn't one. Now, if you have what we call in computer science an oracle, a super powerful presence, then the presence nods and says, yes, my child, you are correct. But that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about a referee who is a, just a mere computer. And this computer has to run in reasonable length of time. And of course, when we talk about reasonable, we'll be a little bit more precise about that in a moment. But not a, not, we're not talking about an oracle who just nods and says, yes, you're right. I'm talking about something that we can check with computers like your smartphone or your tablet or what have you. OK. There are exceptions. So let's once again go back to this data file. And this is the original data file. If you ask, does this graph have a Hamiltonian cycle, you can answer this explicitly and give it a concrete reason. The answer is no. And here is the certificate. I point out to you that vertex 2 in this graph has only one neighbor. It has degree 1. And you can check that by scanning down and finding all the edges that have a 2 in them. And the only one is the second line in the file. So 2 is adjacent to 5, and no other vertex in this graph. So it can't have a Hamiltonian cycle. If it has a Hamiltonian cycle, there has to be an edge coming in and an edge going out. You have to have degree at least two for every vertex. So every human, every computer would accept that. And therefore, the certificate that this graph does not have a Hamiltonian cycle would be accepted. Yes, you are right. But let's go back to the general statement. In general, there does not seem to be a way to provide a certificate to validate a no answer to the question, does a graph have a Hamiltonian cycle? It doesn't mean that there aren't exceptions, and you just saw one. But in general, there does not seem to be. Now, why am I using that language, there does not seem? Why don't I just tell you the answer? It's because I don't know the answer. And the only comfort I take in that is that no one else on the planet knows. It's that hard. 